In this video, we'll show you how MobyMax can fill in for missing instructional time and help prevent learning loss during school closures. As schools have transitioned to remote learning, contact hours with teachers have been decreased and it's become much harder to deliver instruction to students. Teachers are doing a great job of recording videos for their students or scheduling live webinar classes, but compared to the usual seven or eight hours of interaction that students have in a normal school day, this is still relatively minimal. This decrease in instructional time has led to some predictions that students may lose up to a year of academic growth as a result of school closures. MobyMax's learning products are uniquely positioned to help bridge this instructional gap and keep students learning on track for a few reasons. First, every practice set in Moby's learning products is preceded by a Teach Me video that explains the topic and walks through example problems with students. This sets Moby apart from other products that provide practice problems but may not incorporate an instructional component. Because students are working remotely, it's critical that they have a high-quality instructional resource to refer to if they get stuck on a lesson. Second, every problem in Moby's learning products is accompanied by detailed answer feedback. This allows students to correct misunderstandings and learn from mistakes in real time, even when a teacher isn't available to grade or comment on their work. Lastly, every problem in Moby's learning products also has human narration to make sure our curriculum is accessible to all students when they're working on their own. Because of these reasons, MobyMax's learning products can be a huge help for teachers who are looking for a way to squeeze extra instructional hours into the day and make sure students aren't falling behind. Let's take a look at an example lesson to give you an idea of how MobyMax's learning products can fill in for missing instructional hours and keep students progressing. First, we'll quickly review how to assign a lesson from a teacher account, and then we'll take a look at the student perspective. To access Moby's learning modules, Click on the Differentiated Learning panel from your Moby Central home screen. Then choose a subject, find the Lessons tab at the top, and then find the Assign tab. From here, we can pick a student, pick a grade level, and finally, choose a practice set or lesson and click Assign. Next, we'll take a look at the student account to see how Moby leads the student through the lesson. Each lesson starts with a Teach Me video that the student can reference at any time. These videos are created by subject matter experts and former teachers, so you can be sure that your students are getting high quality instruction. After watching the Teach Me video, students complete a set of practice problems. Each problem is graded in real time so your students can see when they make a mistake, and answer feedback is included to explain the correct answer so that students can fix mistakes and misunderstandings moving forward. All problems also include read aloud with human narration so that students never get stuck on a problem when they're working alone. Like all of MobyMax's modules, teachers receive progress monitoring data as students complete their work so you can see which skills students have mastered and where more work is needed. Hopefully this video has shown you how Moby can help shoulder some of the instructional load and keep students moving in the right direction as they're completing their work remotely. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. We're here to help.